Hello YouTube pie smokers, a quick update. First of all, I say a big thank you to Daily Puffer, Bruno, thanks for sending me the sample of Orlick Golden Slice. I've not tried it yet, but when I do, I will uh, do a quick update and tell you what I think. But this quick update is about something that I've invested in. And it's this. Whoa. Yes. Peterson's Special Reserve. 2011. Look at that tin. Whoa. Well, 100 grams, not cheap. I was about to order some Sunset Breeze because I'm out of it, and I saw this. I thought, you know what? I'm going to buy some. It's my birthday several days ago. Poor excuse. Anyway, I'm, I've seen these, the 2009, 10. I thought, I'm going to get some. There was one review in America. And it wasn't fantastic actually, but there again it sounded like it wasn't into aromatics anyway. So I'm an aromatic fan, as you know. And it sounded very interesting. Strawberries. Strawberries! The tin is fantastic. It's a wonderful design. As you can see, it's three of those pesky health labels. I've removed. But it's not, uh, it's not, I don't think it's vacuum packed. It was very lightly sealed. Well, not sealed, it was just shut. And when you open it, this wonderful tobacco was just sealed with this, it was over, like double wrapped over with this plastic bag with this sticker here. It's 100 grams, and when you open it, whoa, if I could smell it, before I opened the packet, it came in. I thought, I can smell that. Wow. I mean, quite a lot of these Peterson's tobaccos have got an amazing aroma, even before you light them. And this is no difference. It's no change. I'm, I'm just sorry, I'm, I'm lost the thought, train of thought there. That is amazing. That's like the best cakes you've ever smelled. I don't know, what can I Whoa! And also, alcohol. Don't think there's anything in it, but if that was alcohol, it would be on the top shelf, under listed under. Be careful. It's very potent. It's absolutely fantastic. As in Daniel Man UK says, you can eat Sunset Breeze. Tell you what, you can bake this, make cakes with it, have a party. It's that good. It's just, whoa, beautiful colour. And it's in the Sabinelli at the moment. Oh yeah. It's gone out. So first impressions, quickly. Oh, why, okay. When you first stoke it up, you can definitely taste Definitely a, it's a curious taste actually. Wonderful aroma, fantastic. I can imagine anyone who doesn't smoke within the vicinity of this is going to say, that's really, really good. It doesn't burn nowhere near as hot as Sunset Breeze, Golden Blend and the rest of them. Because I compared it, uh, when I had Sunset Breeze this of the day when I was outside, um, and inside, it, it does burn quite warm. You've got to be careful of that. But this doesn't. 
effortless smoke as with all Peterson's aromatics. Wow. It's just wonderful. That is definitely a scent of something cakeified. I just made that word up, cakeified. I don't know. Cake. I thought I'd taste marzipan. So some people don't like marzipan and amaretto as well like that, but this is a I'm gonna to have to come back to you with this one because it needs further investigation. I've actually got it this morning and I've had two bottles of it already and uh, I'm impressed. I, you can go, can go over the top of some of these aromatics and things. The room note's good but what about the tobacco itself? What's it taste like? If I didn't know what this was I'd say this is some quality thing. Quality. This is quality tobacco, it is uh, quality aromatics anyway. Mm. It's fantastic. It's hard to pinpoint the taste and aroma at the moment, but I, I definitely absolutely smell strawberries. A strawberry, not not intense, but a strawberry smell. I've never smelled a strawberry tobacco before. And you could think, oh strawberries, is that gonna be a good idea? No, this is uh, this is high quality stuff. I don't know, what could I, what, how could I describe this to you? Yeah. If you're a Sunset Breeze Golden Blend Connoisseur's Choice fan, I would suggest you're going to adore this. What more can I say? I'm a little bit biased. I could like pizza and tobacco, but it's outstanding. Anyway, quick update. That's what it was going to be. I'm here pondering, losing the train of thought, which is not a good thing when you've got stuff to do. I'm off out again soon. Got to shoot off. I'm taking me parts with me. <clears throat> with me man bag. There it is. Again, thanks to Bruno, mate. I hope you get your tin soon. I hope he comes in one piece. If he doesn't, I'll send you another one. Um, but for now, pipe fans, I've got to go. So, I'll see you soon.